Hello, Nachiket. Bless you. I'm new here, and I was wondering if I could get your help. I heard you like to work on the toughest technical problems. Sure. How can I help you? Our biggest customers in the banking industry are relying on us to keep them going even when they have IT disasters. They trust us with their data. One of the things they use is Hive Acid tables to increase the performance of their jobs. But they tell me that we currently do not have any way to recover everything if the cluster goes down. I was wondering if you could make some magic happen to help them out. Oh, by the way, um, we need this yesterday. As usual, PMs are asking for something impossible. I anticipated this and I have put together this prototype. Uh, please let me know if you'll like it or not. Sure. So let me share my screen. Yeah. So these are the two clusters I, I have. Uh, one is source cluster and other one is target cluster. Let me run the show databases command. Uh, so you can see the sales database present on the source. Uh, but on target, uh, the sales uh, database is not present. Right. Uh, let me show you the uh, uh, what are the tables I have in the sales database. Uh, so it has one table region. Uh, let me show you that the table is actually an acid table. So I will run show create table command on region. And when you run that and go all the way to the end, you will see that the transaction is true. That means you see it is an acid table. Uh, let me show you the content of the table as well. So let me run the select star command. Oops, star. And uh, um, let me, this is database, yes. And you will get, so currently it has two rows, um, uh, Africa and America. Uh, now go to the target. Uh, this is the acid policy. So I need to create an acid table replication. I will give it the policy name as um, so this sales policy. I think that is a better name for this. Um, okay. Yes. Then after that, we have to go to st st staging path where we actually copy the data from uh, one cluster to the cluster. It is acid. Uh, table, so we don't need to do external table. This is a database level duplication. So I'm copying the sales database uh, from one cluster to other cluster. Uh, let me be a little bit adventurous and I will set up the interval as one minute. Okay. And I will use the Hive um, as the user. I think everything is set. Let me create a policy. Uh, so you can see that the policy is being created now. Uh, yes. We refresh the page so you will see the policy. Um, uh, yes, this, the policy is actually created. Uh, let me go to the destination and show databases. Uh, now you can see the sales uh, database is already there. Uh, right. Let me see the content of the the table that is uh, we just copied. So that is the sales um, and region table. And if you run the command, uh, you will see that the two uh, two rows, Africa and America, are being copied over here. I just to show you the uh, uh, the type of the table. Uh, so run the command, and again, if you go all the way to the end, you see that that is a transaction. Yes, we do. Yes. Okay. So now what I need to do is I need to add a row to that table. So we already have Africa and America. Let me add one more region, Asia, uh, to region. At the same time, I would like to add another another table. So let's take example of nation. Um, so we need to add nation table inside a uh, sales state database. And uh, let me add uh, one more row uh, to this nation uh, table. And I, I'm adding uh, United States of America as one row. And you, you see that we didn't, we, after creating the policy, we are actually, the policy is running at one minute frequency. 
let's go to target now and see uh, whether uh, we can actually see the new uh, table being copied. Uh, I mean, run the command to see whether the table is being copied at this point or not. So all the changes we made should be reflected here. Yes, ideally, but it takes some time. So just run me one more time. And yes, now it is present. So let me wow. run the command again. Uh, let's run the, uh, to see the content of the uh, region first. And you will see that uh, one, uh, one row that is being added is already added. The Asia is already added here. And I will run the same command on the nation to see that one row that is present over there is already did over here.